There's one word that I'm going to bet that you've used, if not today, this week, that absolutely sabotages our success more than any other word out there. Let's find out what that is today. What happens if you're going to have a party, you invite a whole bunch of friends and someone comes back to you and says, I'll try to be there, okay? What happens? In your mind's eye, you've already written them off. You know the moment they say, I'm going to try to be there, they're not going to show. And why is that? It's back to the fact that our brains work in pictures. Okay, words paint pictures. Words are just a surface level. So if you say, I am going to try to cross this room. What's the picture that you've got in your head? If you've got a room in your mind's eye, specific room, are you right where you started at this end of the room? Are you at the far end or are you in the middle? If you say, I'm going to try to cross the room, the picture is probably that you're still over on this side, haven't started, or maybe you've just started a little bit somewhere in the middle, not even halfway. So the picture that you create is failing. The moment you say, I'm going to try to do this, you've created a picture of failing and that's what you're telling your unconscious mind to do. So if you say, I'm going to try to get you the report on time, you've programmed yourself to fail. If you say, I'm going to try to to help you, you're setting yourself up to fail and you've made an uh, excuse in your mind to not help because you're only trying. Okay, you can say I'm going to try out something, but to say you're going to try is to fail. So in the mortal words of Yoda, do or do not, there is no try. Tell me what you've discovered about the word try and how it works in your life or doesn't in the comments below.